Everybody have a seat. Thank you. Thank you. Well, good morning. And uh, welcome to the first ever White House Maker Fair. We're just pretty excited. We, uh, we invited you here today because today is uh, DIY. T today's DIY is tomorrow's Made in America. Uh, your projects are examples of a revolution that's taking place in American manufacturing, uh, a revolution that can help us create new jobs and industries for decades to come. And while uh, I don't know if the projects here today are the next Apple, I, I do know that by looking at some of these uh, exhibits, uh, it was just incredible what uh, is being done. So you take the team from the workshop school in West Philadelphia, and compared to most other schools, there are a lot of advantages they don't have. There's a poor community. Uh, they do have, however, Simon uh, Hogger, a, a, a principal who's so talented, a student once said he could teach uh, algebra to a guinea pig. Uh, and, and with Simon's help, we've got Derek Bell here, uh, Talia Carter, Joshua Pigford. Their team built a biodiesel sports car that gets around 100 miles per gallon, uh, which is why the Secret Service didn't let me drive it. <laughs> but what's happening is, is that the young people now are able to learn by doing. So math, science, all gets incorporated into uh, the task of actually making something, uh, which the students tell me uh, makes uh, the subject matter that much more interesting. What uh, the maker movement does, what technology does, uh, what uh, the information revolution does, uh, is it allows all those folks to suddenly uh, be a part uh, of this creative process. Uh, and what better place to do that than here in the United States of America? This is a place where we know how to invent, and we know how to dream, and we know how to take risks. Uh, and this is a place where uh, people who work hard have always been able to make it. Uh, we want to make sure that continues. So thanks for the great work you're all doing. It's very inspiring. God bless you. God bless the United States of America. Thank you.